Hey guys, MTG Noob here. Uh, this hand's not good enough. I mean, this card's clearly going to bite me in the butt, so let's mull. This hand's much better. Can't cast these, but I could try to at least ride the ooze out. So let's not poke ourselves. Play this. Depends on what we're playing against. Um, it's going to be difficult to... Do this. I guess we can always take it out to determine sense. <clears throat> you know, should we leave regeneration? Should we not leave regeneration up? Uh oh, humans. Well, let's bash. See if he wants to block. I can't see how he does, yeah. I wouldn't think so. Alright, now we're going to be in trouble if he throws down a Silverblade Paladin on this, which doesn't look likely. Tended Knight. Tended Knight does first strike. See if that War Falcon's doing anything. We are just drawing oozes for universes. Um, this is just going to get eaten, and I don't really feel like losing dudes to it. Maybe that's incorrect. I think he just takes. Let's play another ooze, and um, we'll pass. Currently, we are super ahead, winning the war. I don't know how I did that. Oblivion Ring. Nobody does that. It's messed up. The Zeus is gone. Oh, this, he's going crazy. Why would you remove that ooze? Pithing needle. All right, it's fine. I could still technically blow him out. So I can't regenerate. He just wants to race. Sure. I'll take five. I don't think he's winning this race. We'll swing back five. Play another ooze. Ram will pass. And the, I don't. I still don't get why he didn't remove this one. Okay, it's fine. Okay, we'll go to eight. Swing with both oozes. Oh god. He'll chump. This will become a 5-5. Five five. Alright, the fact that he chumps makes me not worried to take this. The question is, would this have been better as a Thrag Tug Tusk here? The answer is probably. Going up to 11 is pretty good. But I don't see how we're going to lose this. This tramples, unless he has an O-ring for this. Then we can't really get through with these. Clone. Ugh, that's yucky. I was not expecting to see a clone. We might lose now. <laughs> Guild gate is not what we want. <clears throat> okay. So we swing, swing, swing. He's just got to survive this. So I think I have to go all in here. He 
He's at nine. I think he's got this. That clone was very timely. Probably should have pumped the brakes at some point. But we'll see. Blocks there. Blocks there. Blocks there. Yeah, this was an errant attack. Yep, you got it. Okay. So he's got knights that fly. I think I might want these in here. They don't hit his knights, but they might hit something else. Triumph will probably have bigger dudes. Tree I don't think I want. Sever I do want. Let's see. I think I want Triumph. I don't think we need Deathrite Shamans in this matchup. Trolls lose value, but they still trample over somewhat. He's got O-rings, so definitely want the Golgari charms. Four repeats, not too sure about. I'd rather him not have a really good clone target. I mean, I want the spider. It does make it almost impossible for him to deal with this, though. All of our guys are not technically bigger than his. Garrick still seems fine. He had a tended knight, which was pretty annoying. Um, yeah, I think I'm good with this. I gotta cut, make one cut. This should be a house against him. All right, I'll cut this. He's he's only got that one flyer, it seems. I can technically bring in the trees, but I don't think they're as good. Yeah, we're gonna keep this. It's a little bit slow, but we're gonna keep this. Rancor is is pretty strong against him. He doesn't have any like instant speed removal, so. Alright, now the question is, do I want to go Troll or Shrine Root Geist? I think I'm going to go with Shrine Root Geist here and just bash for two. Assuming he doesn't have an unsummon. Plus, if he would have played Knight of Glory there, that would have been pretty bad for us. Alright, who wants to go all in? Hmm. I think it's better to have two targets. Let's play this guy. We don't really have to worry about the regeneration here. Okay, Tended Knight. <clears throat> Tended Knight's just going to kill this, which is really annoying. I think we'll trample this guy up. Swing with both. We know he's going to kill this. But then I'll get Rancor going on this guy. And that should be good. And then I'm hoping I can hit here. And this will come back as a 3-2. Okay, so we'll regenerate this. Okay. These will come back. Yeah, he gets to kill it before it deals damage. Just slightly annoying. Maybe I should have chucked the Wolfier Avenger, but I don't think I needed to there. We're not going to lose to one first strike guy. I'm just not going to let it happen. It's going to just piss me off too much if we just lose to one attended knight. Hopefully he plays another one and we sever it. Pacifism. Sure. Ok. 
Okay, we will pass. We'll bring this in. Okay, Oblivion Ring, probably Stranger Geist, which is fine. And now I'm going to just probably get to kill his guy for free. Assuming he doesn't have an Essence Scatter, of course. You never know when you're playing against these rogue decks. <clears throat> Alright. Play news. It's probably better to just play Garrick, but I think we're alright. Draw two cards. Play Tender Knight. Oblivion Ring. Okay, it's fine. He's got to run out of Oblivion Rings eventually. I'm not going to kill my own guy because it'll just kill Garruk. I'll just make wolves. And that should be good. <clears throat> if I need to on my turn, I can do this. Get Rancors back, throw them on, and then sever whatever he's doing on his end. Or he could just have the third Oblivion Ring. Okay, that's totally fine by me. Crack that fetch. All right. Um, I guess we'll go for this. This is kind of greedy, but why the heck not? Why not? Yeah. Okay. Not that greedy, I guess. So what we we're gonna do is gonna get our uh, rancors going. All right. Um, <clears throat> duress doesn't seem to really do too much. I'm not a big fan of these first striking guys. Um, I think I'm going to run this back though. Seemed like we were totally in control that match, so. This is a keeper. Okay, this is much better. Not great, but much better. <laughs> That's a lot of woodland cemeteries. I'll, I'll play possum with my land coming in play tapped. Do 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 do. Essence scatter. I guess. Okay. That does not bother me that he's turning into a control deck. Attended night. Now, if he has another essence scatter for this, then we're kind of in trouble. Okay, we'll eat this one. Nom 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 nom. Oh, all right, we'll still eat that. We will nom it up. That was a smart attack by him. Props. He now has props. This guy regenerates, right? We're racing five for five? Sure. Then <laughs> no see he took my previous play from the game prior and was like, oh, he doesn't know that double first strike will kill his guy, so if he regenerates it, he regenerates it. Alright, that's a blowout, but there's not much we could do about that. I'm not too worried. We have two lands and a Rancor in hand. Oh, he just stole Rancor? Pfft, sure. I guess I guess that's fine. 
No, you're not winning this race. I said it last time, but this time I mean it. You're not winning this race currently. He's probably got a good follow-up play, that's why. Oh my god, really? Yeah, that's trouble. Well, now I'm going to lose because I uh, wasted this ultimate prize. <laughs> Faithy. Alright, well now this is going to be quite the uphill battle with this Rock's Faith Mender up in the house. Rock's Faith Mender and trading posts. So random. He's going to gain a million's life a block. Do I want this Rancor back? What even happens? Goes to my graveyard. Is it from play even? We'll play defense some more. We're we're in for the long haul. So many goats. Doesn't he know I'm gonna blow out all his goats? Goat cheese. Double faith mender. This is gonna be very bad. That's alright. I still think we can win this. He's just gonna gain a lot of life. Sure. So many goats. Why are you making a goat army, sir? That's fine. Wolf Hero Avenger will not regenerate. Oh, Grim Backwoods. Boo. That sucks. Now we're all about this regeneration. So if I swing, what happens? I think I'm gonna swing. Let's find out. We're just really screwed because this plus this is like lethal. Well, that was interesting. That's a quirky little combo that he's got going. Okay. That's fine. I don't know why you wouldn't put that on this, but okay. <laughs> Let's grim backwards this just for the heck of it. Do 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 do. Do 
All right, so we have to be able to kill these without him getting the trading post off. So we're going to let him sack this. He's just going to sack one. Uh, we're in uh, we're in trouble here, I think. All right, let's see if we could uh, mind game him here. We're gonna see if we can get him to sack all his goats and his soldier to bring back the pithing needle and then we're going to kill his rocks faith menders he's too smart <laughs> alright well we'll just blow one up then and we'll let him sack it and then that'll happen and then he'll get back pithing needle and I'll probably name this and then we can always just buy this back and kill it. Pithing needle naming. It's got to name stuff. It's got to, it's always got to name something. <laughs> Dun 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 snap block snap block Swinging for eight. That's pretty good. I'm not going to play out this land. I want him to think I have something. So, oh, a third one? That just sucks. So many rocks, faith menders. Six. Tempted to kill this, but I don't really have anything else I can draw into currently. He will make a jote. I don't know, he's going to gain eight life. That's all. I have no idea what this is, but this looks annoying. Yep, we're going to lose. Okay, so he can have this, this, this is an infinite combo, just so you know. Oblivion Ring, Archaeomancer... There we go. I don't even think that was right. Let me know what you would have done, because I don't think that was right. Alright, let's just get past this. I gotta draw something good here over our next two draw steps. Tracker's good. But I think we're going to die. <laughs> I 
Alright, we gotta craft a turn here. He's got two unsummons. So he's just gonna unsummon this no matter what I do. So we're pretty much, I would say, locked out of this game. So he's got swing five, unsummon, rebuy it. He's got two unsummons, so no matter what I do, we're just in trouble. Sometimes decks just work. This is one of those times. Apparently, this is a very bad matchup for us. <laughs> Just gonna let that happen. Okay, it's fine. Still got one on seven. What can we draw? Sack of Wolf. We're digging for answers here. And I think we've just dug our grave. This is not going to die because he's just going to unsummon it. And we've got Tracker. Which is definitely not even going to kill anything. We'll make a Tracker here. We will pass. Yep. I guess I should have waited. I wasn't anticipating he'd have three faith menders. I think the crucial misplay was ultimate pricing his tendon knight to kill both. That might have been a boo boo. Still at 10, so we have a series of draws, but now he's going to get to reload with the Sphinx. And I mean, if we have this going, we can do things. So we're not completely dead. But I would think he's going to buy back the Pithing Needle naming tracker if he doesn't just Oblivion Ring it or pacify it. Well, pacifism won't do anything. Oh, well, that's nice. Okay, sack my guy, sure. Well, at least I have a goat. Goat. That's the sound goats make. Name Garrick. Yep, we're screwed. I might name Grim backwards, but I think he's going to name Garrick. Too bad I didn't bring in the giant spider, right? If it would have brought in the spider, then we would have been looking good. Well, on a plus, if this game goes long, we just can win the mill war. Okay, let's do this. Now I'm reduced to sound effects. Get this rancor back. Gonna rancor up a goat. Oh, God. It's just not good. All right, guys, I've had enough. That deck just whooped our butt. All right, thanks for watching. Please check out the m2gnoob.com.